Hey, what is going on guys? It is Jaco back again with another video and we just got some disappointing news that GTA 6 may not be coming out until 2025. Knowing how real or fake that is, regardless, we're waiting a really long time till we get GTA 6. The any new sort of content Rockstar is currently making for us, I like my many many others, Rockstar is my favorite game developing company. They have made uh, my favorite games of all time, the Grand Theft Auto series, Red Dead Redemption. But the only really new thing that they're gonna do in the upcoming years that we even know about other than GTA 6 is GTA 5 remastered, did, 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 expanded and enhanced in version for the PS5 and the Xbox Series X. Well, I got tired of waiting. Um, you know, her hearing that GTA 6 news got kind of depressing. So I decided to remaster GTA 5 myself with a little graphics mod, literally called GTA 5 remastered and you look off into the sky you see the airstreams like way more uh, visible I should say um, I added you know the lighting and just the colors overall look so much better I even added a few more uh, gore and like gun mods myself to just make this game feel more realistic and just more overall fun and just a different feel especially some different sound effects and stuff like that through guns and well so if you guys do end up enjoying please remember to drop a like and subscribe turn on post notifications and I'm gonna be showcasing some of these mods and you know just having some fun with it uh, one thing I do like to mention like other than the light uh, bouncing off the car here is that one of the mods I believe the GTA 5 remastered graphics mod I'm using it, look at the look at the extra detail on the bullet hole in the glass not only is it bigger but like look at the extra detail around it that is insane that, that, that looks really cool the glass itself still breaks normally after you yeah, there we go. You know, it still breaks normally. It just looks a little different. And like I said, I downloaded a few extra mods myself. Probably my favorite feature that doesn't belong in GTA 5 actually belongs in GTA 4. Now, GTA 4, it was called Euphora Ragdoll, and it's also used in Red Dead Redemption. In GTA 5, they went in a different direction. I don't even know what the Ragdoll engine is called in GTA 5. But I added GTA 4's Euphoria mod, and here is what it looks like. Look at that. Look at that. It just looks so much better. You know, you don't instantly just drop after you get shot in the toe, you know, or shot in the finger. GTA 5, it's pretty unrealistic. It still looks good. It's just not as realistic as GTA 4's. GTA 4's is by far the better option. I mean, look at that. He's just kind of like stumbling and like, oh, oh yeah, and I added some like kind of blood mods. And you may or may not hear the difference in the micro SMG and the way it sounds. Ooh, and here are the cops. Perfect. Now I get some target practice with my new mods. Where are you going? There we go. Just spray him down. God, that is so much more satisfying with this mod. Real quick, I'm going to let the cops kind of just light me up uh, for a second. Just so I can show you guys uh, the detail that goes into the blood on Trevor once they actually start shooting me. Like the bullet holes, they look really good. Um, what, I am wearing armor, so that the shots that you see hitting the armor, or the body armor right now, the bulletproof vest, uh, don't really show a lot of blood because I mean it's hitting a vest. There we go I had to turn down those sound effects because they are so much louder than the base game But look at the detail and like the blood on Trevor's arm Like oh my god, it looks so much so much better than the base game The, the developers of these mods work so hard and do such a good job just to like you know improve the the game that's you know should already be being improved or just being a main fucking rockstar just make a new fucking game please 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 make a new fucking game all right let's just drop him he's gonna stumble back do the little nay nay yep there we go there you go just light this little bastard up oh and i also got the help of a little mod menu some of the some of the things you may see in this video come from this mod menu menu uh, very, very good single-player menu. Does not work online. I don't, <laughs> I don't mod online, Rockstar. What are you talking about? FBI, open up! And the graphics mod, though the draw distance is pretty much the same, but there is definitely way more detail, you know, just in colors. The, all right, we're gonna jump off the skyscraper. Hopefully I don't have a pair. I do have a parachute, okay. You know what? We can change that. We're just gonna spam F, and there we go. <laughs> Here's a Euphoria ragdoll. Oh my god, that looks so much better. Oh, uh, there we go, splat. Oh, Trevor, are you okay? Oh. All right, we've seen the daylight uh, for some time now. I want to add... Ooh, I forgot I added <laughs> mass. I increased my mass. <laughs> oh my god, that looks... Oh, the explosions. 
do look a little bit better. Hold on, I'll check that out in a sec. Oh, that looks really good. Look at the lightning. Holy crap, that looks so much better in, in this mod. Oh my god, this looks... I didn't think it would look better at night. Look at how this game looks at night now. Oh my god, it looks so much better. Pre-alpha sport mode before... It was much more controlled into the way we know now today. Okay, so I just added a laser sight to my gun now. This is something that could easily be added to the game. I'm surprised how little weapon attachments or just like weapons overall are added to GTA 5. Considering this is literally a game about running around killing people. Oh god, how is he still rolling around? Jesus Christ. Alright, I'm gonna go in first person and pop off some shots. Oh my god, it looks so much better. Holy crap, look at this. He's just gonna like stumble, stumble around. Boink! Go night night, go night night. Let's try a shotgun, a regular old pump shotgun. Oh my god, it looks so good. It sounds so good too. I know this gun looks cool, the AK here. Oh. Oh, that looks so amazing. Holy shit. It's over here nutting my pants. What? Uh, the interiors of cars don't look all that different but then again i'm not usually in interiors of cars in first person so uh i usually drive third person because i'm not a retard all right let's head over to the gas station and uh rob it here let's put this car right into the gas pump there we go god those explosions look oh okay okay oh i'm now stumbling around <laughs> what the hell okay this is just how trevor walks now oh god uh, uh, okay, I'm good. Just walk in with a Molotov and just throw a Molotov. Well, how did this car get into the door? Are you serious? I can't get in now. What the hell? Okay, we're gonna have to move this car real quick. Okay, let's just walk in and throw Hey, everything in the register now. Come back here. Where are you going? Come back here. What are you doing? Catch. Oh, oh, <laughs> yep. They definitely f flail around a lot more uh, when they're in fire. It's... <laughs> That like, seems kind of weird. Alright, let's take the money. Jeez, Trevor, you do not look so hot. Oh, boy. Get out of the way. Oh, my God, the fire looks way better. You can actually see more blue in it for, like, the heat. Show heat. There you go. Catch. Everyone catch. Free Molotovs. It's happy hour somewhere. <laughs> catch. Oh, God, now I just hear screaming. The, so the screaming sounds of my enemies. Maybe this wasn't a great teleport idea with the car. Because now that door's blocked off. But here's a life invader office. This is a very cool and colorful place uh, in the story mode. And this actually looks phenomenal, uh, this interior now. Alright, but since we're, <laughs> since we're showcasing uh, weapon mods, might as well shoot it up, right? Oh my god, look at the blood on the screen. Oh boy. You good, pal? No? Okay. All right, but now that I have showcased the mods pretty well, you guys get the gist of it by now. I actually do want to go and start a story mission, and I kind of want to even start a new game. Why I want to start a new game? Because it'd be a really fun modding series, modding single player and going through the story. And since we got this new graphics mod, it'd be like we're playing the remastered version, you know, kind of get a new taste, a new feel. Um, while also playing the story mode, so let me know if you guys are actually interested in that But I think I'll just choose a random story mission that I actually really like uh, just at random So yeah. one of the best missions in this game by far Hood Safari has one of the best cutscenes too. This is a great way to, to showcase this mod, these mods, truly. You wanna be a greedy fucking cow, huh? Ah, best line in the game. Chop, oh, Chop, Chop looks like a cute little doggy as always. I forgot to mention, I also added a speedometer. That's uh, just with menu. Pretty minor mod, but something that could easily be added in GTA, you know? They have the speedometer, you know, in interiors, but how accurate those are, I, I, I don't even wanna know. Yeah, motherfucker. This Grove Street bitch. Oh, uh, Grove Street looks so much better. I think some of these trees, these palm trees, were added into Grove Street. Wow, this looks way better. There we go. Shoot him right in the nuts. Oh, uh, there we go. Let's light these feckers up. Feck off. Feck off. Yeah. It's a gangbang, motherfucker. Ooh. 
I didn't notice the bullet holes in the car. And they look a little different. They, they do differ in size, though, which is kind of, I guess, pretty cool. There we go. Shootouts and just the gunplay overall feels so much more satisfying and just, just so much more fun. It's truly a shame that Rockstar didn't add Euphoria, uh, GTA 4 rag, ragdolling system back into GTA 5 when they made this game back in 2013. That was such a shame. Oh my gosh, there we go, money. Man, we don't need to run. I'm invincible right now. Let's just take on these feckers. Nope, I'm not gonna listen to you, Lamar. You don't know shit. I'm gonna keep firing. I'm a one-man army. You don't know me, Lamar. Oh, I need to catch up to him, that's right. Get behind me. Oh god, they're coming from everywhere. Oh god. Just keep moving and shooting. Alright. Hey, oh, MC clip! MC clip! Oh god. Franklin got a hit in the head. <laughs> Jesus, you can see like the inside of his skull. That's kind of crazy. Hey, yo, fuck you, MC clip. Music's trash, bitch. Yeah. Oh, come on. Come on, dance for me, bitch. <laughs> there we go. Oh my god, what's he doing? <laughs> what the hell? Oh my god. Oh, 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 yeah, right, we're escaped from the caps. Hey, yo, fuck you, bitch. Aw, uh, here we go. Shoot out their tires, Lamar. Oh, this gun <laughs> feels way stronger. There we go, I killed everyone. All right, one thing I want to try right before uh, we hop off the video is I want to try the advanced sniper, just a sniper rifle in general, and just see what they sound and how they feel. Uh, here, that's perfect. Let's just shoot at these guys. Oh, that sniper feels so good. Oh, or just sounds, sorry, sounds super good. Yeah, oh my god, that one shot. Oh my god, look at that gash you just put in him. All right, put a bullet right in his head. Jesus, this feels, oh my god. And I'm just picking them off one by one. This is going on my sniper montage. All right, but that's the last thing I really wanted to show with this graphics mod. The weapon and ragdoll mods I have on makes this game feel just that more satisfying. And just turns this entire game and all its gameplay into a brand new experience. Just feels way better. Well, anyways, guys, if you do want to see more of this, let me know. I, I don't know. I've just been really into single player games and especially modding them lately. Um, so let me know if you guys want to see more single player mods. And uh, another thing that I am going to do at the end of this video is make a little Rockstar editor version. It's like the cinematic cameras and that kind of stuff. Uh, I had a, a few clips put together. You guys probably saw me using Rockstar editor in the corner for some time there in this video. So you guys are going to see a little compilation of clips put together through Rockstar editor. I haven't done that in a long time. And that's actually what I originally started doing on my channel. So uh, yeah, you're gonna, you guys are going to see a few minutes of that. So... Uh, without further ado, thanks again guys for watching. Please remember to drop a like and subscribe, turn on post notifications, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.
wishing well now.